Brand mid. Ooh, that's fine. I like that. Okay, good choice against Zoe. Um, so it means that you can flex the Vlad up towards the top lane. You have the Cassid in. Joker's stolen one before. Cold, a level disadvantage. Oh, oh level exile. Exile gets jumped on. Look for the stun here as Giants collapse. Three members there. The double stun with the Tarek. And that's a lot of damage. Joker's going to go down first, though. Exile still dodging around the fight. Totoro gets the Kajasa blows. And now Targamas is not in the best of shape. The blue goes to Cold. Betsy caught out. Oh, he he gets a kill. He's just about going to survive. Targamas there as well. But Exile's not done yet. Betsy down. And the Unicorns of Love have capitalized on some counter jungling. The paddle starts to Targamas. Looking for the double buff, but here comes Steel back the heel! Samux gets it! And somehow the Unicorns <laughs> come out alive! He's not even getting any CS at this point because Samux is just zoning him away. Here we go, first, first turn. power goes down, Samix gets all of the gold. So it's an opportunity for Giants to play around the top side of the map. We talked about Ruin's ability to dive onto the back line with the Vladimir. It could work out, he's scaling very quickly towards a, a very threatening black lane against a Cassidy who can't wave clear and Unicorns of Love can actually rush down this turret at least get some damage on it that's what they're doing now meanwhile Betsy and Targumas are like yeah this sucks <laughs> it's not where you want to be Targumas still only level 6 on this Tarek does have the ultimate and the dazzle of course as Betsy jumps in once again but forced back the tower is just about going to fall as the Unicorns of Love get their second time. There's a lot of skill involved in how they're going to teamfight. We get that swap top lane. Ruin should have expected this one. Yeah, Tojo flashes across the wall, looking for the concussive blows. There's the Hemo Plague as well. Didn't actually connect onto anyone as Ruin tries to get away. Flash, Proto Belt, cold on the chase. Nice. Here. Does have the Cataclysm. There's a concussive blow stun, and Samix will help Toto secure the kill. To take it down. But they're going to trade now. Bottom lane tower for Giants. Top lane tower is going to go to Unicorns. Giants might push for a second. Gonna. Seed die. So a, a reason that Giants mid game tanked. you in and killed his own mid laner. Oh, okay, they're fighting fight now. Right now as Joker gets engaged upon Samix forced away. Betsy Dale towards the top side. Teleport coming in from the Unicorns as well. The oh, Ruin behind him. Ruin is behind him. Hema playing Samix. They're looking for the kill. Steelback's going to jump across as well. But Samix surviving. Steelback. So aggressive. They get the kill. They get two. And now Giants are turning on to the Unicorns. Target S low. Oh, oh, they get oh, it down. Down the bottom side. The minions got that. But Exile can pump out the damage here. Paddle starts at the base of Ruin. Has the flash across the wall. And in the end, the Giants oh, win. Exile low. goes in. That's another kill. Let's see if that's really getting towards that infinity edge. So. Although it's a 4,000 gold lead now for the Unicorns of Love, they are. And Bomb Exile is dead instantly, or Samix is dead instantly, and Giants can win the fight. And Baron has not been taken yet, so the game is this split. Deficio, they have struggled when it comes to taking the first Baron. They've struggled with the engages as well. As once again, the Fisher comes out. They're trying to get onto Samix, but he can jump the wall into Toro. Now he's going to sacrifice himself, as Giants will get another kill. But now again, this first Baron, the ninth in the league. The amount of bounds they take in their games is 10th, and once again we have a fight as Joker's caught out in the ban pit. Is he going to be able to escape? He gets the smite, but Totoro gets the kill. <laughs> and the... <laughs> oh, really? Oh, but he's going to engage us at Exile now as well. Hemo Plague jumps in with the Sanguine Pool. Exile's down, a shutdown. Goes Golden as he tries to survive the flash away. There's the Cosmic Radiance. Here we go. Oh, no. Invulnerable for long enough. Steel back now, pounding down damage from the side onto Samix, onto Cold. Targamus and Betsy trying to survive. Let's go, Steel back. Are pushing forward. It's all on Steel back. Betsy gets one, though. He's going to get another in the back line. It's Samix who secures it, and now Steel back's jumping in. But Samix is too big at the he moment. He's going to get a Penta, but kind of had to dance in and out and couldn't secure all the kills. Giants, though, despite it being a little bit more careful, but he has uh, he has the cleanse. Steel back towards the bottom side of this. There's Glacial Prison, but Exile jumps in, cleanse away the sleep. Exile's going to get a paddling onto Steel back, and that is a dead AD carry. One for one. As Giants now try and retreat because they do not have Tristana, another sleep lands. The flash across the wall, but the chase with the Fisher. The Unicorns want this jungle, and they will secure him. Two for one, and chasing for a bit more. Ruins pool is gone now. Pools away. There's the flash as well. Exile jumping forward. White Knight there. Can get some damage down onto Ruin. Oh, just for that. Doesn't get it. The Dazzle, the Drowsy as well. The Paddle Star might connect, but there's the stopwatch. Tugmas puts up a shield. Gonna take a lot of damage, and there's the kill for Exile. He puts another sleep down and uses a stopwatch just to delay time a little bit. Here's Betsy. Oh! But Exile's too deep. Manages to flash away. Gets on Betsy. He baited it. And he baited Exile it. survives. Doesn't now have the stopwatch. Oh, doesn't have hiding. the photo belt. Does have. A lot of damage from the side there. Still back as well, trying to keep himself alive. There's a Hemo Plague. Still back onto Totoro. We'll be able to secure the kill in the end. Heals, flashes away as well. 
True Shop Barrage not going to connect with the Unicorns of Love. Do not want to give up this chase. Cold jumping in the double knockup with the flash. Dazzle comes out as well, but Samus can rain hell upon the faces of the Giants as they fall down one by one. Exile with the sleep doesn't quite connect. Does in the end with oh, the he's slipping. Samus looking for it. Gets the kill. Joker gets jumped on. Samus with a triple, and Giants are falling apart. The two carries and Unicorns of Love showing up based on Castle and Vladimir. Didn't get there yet. Then the fight broke out. They lost the A to carry instantly, and while we That's keep... the exile that the Unicorns want. That's the exile we have seen in... Not able to get anything with it. Holy moly, yeah. that's a lot of damage on Steelback. Ezreal... Oh. oh! See, that block we should have followed. Practicing following them is important, and very important for the Unicorns as well, that they crack into this oh, inhibitor. Hit another one, hit another one. Then he missed. Thanks for the update, Deficio. That was my play-by-play. -play. <laughs> inhibitor goes down in the mid lane, so does the second tier tower in the bot. As the Unicorns get a 10,000 gold lead and are looking for their second inhibitor of the game. Glacial Prison does not connect from Joko, trying to force the Unicorns back. Ruin jumps in, but he is done! Exile removes him from the Summoner's Rift. Cosmic Radiance comes down. It's only going to take Targumus for a time. Betsy forward. The Drowsy's going to land again. And Exile says oh. goodbye oh. to Betsy. The Unicorns of Love are stampeding over Joko. They're going to win this game right here. Both carries are so fed in this game here. Exile hits everything at the moment. A 1 and 8 team didn't look like a 1 and 8 team. The best 1 and 8 team we have ever seen, you said, Deficio. Well, the Unicorns of Love are going to re reward their faithful fans here with their second victory in the EU LCS. They'll wipe Giants off the map and they will take down the Nexus. A great first game today. We continue the action from yesterday. Tonic, because this all started level 1 with a fight over a red buff into then a fight over a blue buff that resulted Unicorn! in three kills no! for Unicorns. Second win of the split for this team. And they managed to punish a Giants lineup that's currently struggling.